So yes people, welcome to the channel True Jamaican Vibes Fire Reads. So today I go to Red Bank. So this is my favorite bar I like to stop. Yeah man at Sumon Hot Spot, you know. But today the bar kinda closed me and passed through was a disappointment for me because when we come here so we kinda feel different when we stop and have a drink with it. Yeah man, big up yourself Sumon. Anyway they big up yourself. You don't know so yes we always stop and have our cool red stripe beer. Anyway it's part of the Sumon large you know yeah man so there's someone place very very nice area for stop you know when they talk about customer service someone have all of that so when now pass through red bank top of someone place with people and support the bar very very nice bar also customer service well taken care of someone at your place with the they are passed through, but we never really place close, you know? One love and one heart. Welcome to the channel guys, True Jamaica the Vibes Fire Raid. So I am in St. Elizabeth, one place them call them Rose, Rose Hall. Yeah man, them call it Rose Hall. Think this Rose Hall over the south side of St. Elizabeth guys. So this is a countryside of Jamaica in the St. Elizabeth area guys. So enjoy the tour. With your tour guide fire read. So this channel is all about Jamaica. Where to go, when to go. Big up yourself and the way I watch from man. Big up yourself. Yes man, I'm talking to you. You are watching video, so I big up you anyway I watch from. Because it, if it wasn't for you guys, this channel would not be growing. So big up on yourself, man. Thanks a lot for the support we we'll give to the channel. You know, many different areas in Jamaica where we only hear about on TV, never get the chance to see the area, what it is like. And here you can get a chance to see it on Fiery Channel, your Jamaican tour guide. So when I know end up on the countryside, you see a lot of different trees, fruit trees. Sweet sap, sour sap, mango. You know, say I saw mango time and I went to Jamaica. Yeah, man, it's the mango tree blossom. So, when you know it's mango season in Jamaica, it's also crab season in Jamaica, guys. In the May, May time is like crab season in Jamaica, guys. So, take a tour in the Rosal area, guys, and tell me what you think, what you think about this area. If you would live in this area guys, leave your comment in the section and tell me, let, let us interact on this channel. Let me know what you think about Jamaica, because a lot of people don't want to come back to Jamaica because they live now because reality, they see a lot of crime and violence that take place in Jamaica, but I try to bring back the positive vibes in Jamaica, not everywhere are violence. <laughs> that every place are bad in Jamaica where you go because all over the world things happen we don't hear about but all the Jamaica get mostly being highlighted on the map so I leave everybody to their opinion to me Jamaica is a very nice place to me you can leave it in the comment section and tell me what you think I don't, I don't know you know what you think, you know, just giving you my opinion. Mother live in Jamaica. Straight show. Son, just tell me what I go on. Tell me your views on Jamaica, guys. Like up the video. Like it up, man. Like it up, man. Yeah, man. I tell me what you think about Jamaica. Because, you know, Many times we come to Jamaica, we always try to stop in the city. 
you would have said the pretty part of Jamaica. But a lot of people forget about the countryside in Jamaica. I know that countryside in Jamaica is best to me. Fire read. Because when we are the countryside, there is so much niceness that go on in the country, so much things you can do. The breath of fresh air in the countryside, guys, is a different feeling. Till in the morning time when I get up in the countryside and go in, go in the river, it's like a different feeling, different sensation. Drive out in the early morning in the Rose Hall, St. Elizabeth. The fresh air the way you get mean a lot on the countryside. So on your right, you have the Rose Hall rainwater catchment tank. So you know you have a catchment tank in the Rose Hall, guys. Don't forget about that catchment tank, you know, because you know, say rainwater. A lot of people love the rainwater. Natural things we are dealing with around here, you know, very natural, you know. Yes, people, don't dirty up Jamaica. You see a lot of garbage right there. Hopefully soon the garbage collector can remove them garbage from there. Because we know Jamaica want to keep the island clean because we have our young kids growing up. Not healthy for them when they throw garbage all over the place. So you also know you have a Rose Hall, a Rose Hall in Montego Bay. I think it's in St. James area, guys. But we also have a Rose Hall in St. Elizabeth. And we all know St. Elizabeth is the bread basket. So the man them plant them corn on the roadside, you know. Corn and cabbage, you know. So the people sometimes we need to go into the backyard and farm up the land, grow something in the yard. Because we all know organic, organic way is the best way to go. So just grow something in the yard, man. No matter what, plant no hot pepper, plant no cabbage, plant no sweet pepper, any little thing you can grow in the backyard. When they that town, you know, we don't, we don't have the land space to so grow now, farmer. Fruits are vegetables, so when you come a country, and this are the niceness there. Just run out in the backyard and pick a mango. This man just come down fast, you know, really, I watch the road, he just speed. So now, if you watch out for them bad drivers, you know, my people, look at this farm right here. Very pretty, tomato and also sweet pepper very very nice farm tell about the country life when you ride with all of love one power and bite back tell me how you feel it's a nice feeling guys But I see I look around for gold for the main, you know. Some people no matter where you go in Jam no matter where you go in where you go in Jamaica. You got always see the people that build up them beautiful houses, no matter how small, they still looking good the same way. Still looking good, guys. So 
guys, welcome to Red Bank. Yeah, man. So, you know, it's part with you now. Welcome to Red Bank Primary School Silent Zone. So, me am Red Bank today. Red Bank, a free place. Yeah, man. Red Bank. We all heard about Red Bank all the while. So on your left guys, we have the Red Bank, welcome to Red Bank, I think it's the primary school, could be the primary, yeah the primary school of Red Bank guys. So when I come to a red bank, you can stop at a bar having a red stripe beer. Yeah man, anything you want to drink, you can drink. Yeah man, no cold Heineken or Jagan. Just have a drink, free up the mind and hit the road again. So this is a red bank in St. Elizabeth guys. I don't know the reason why they maybe call it red bank because over this side, I think it's uh, the, the soil is kind of different. The soil is more red, more fertile. So maybe that's why they call over here the Red Bank area, guys. So big up on yourself, the paper, big up on yourself. Big up on yourself, man, big up on yourself, big up on yourself, big up on yourself. So this is my favorite bar I like to stop. Yeah man, at someone had spot, you know. But today the bar kinda closed me I passed through was a disappointment for me because when we come here so we kinda feel different when we stop and have a drink with it. Yeah man, big up yourself some more. Anyway, they big up yourself. You don't know, so yes, we always stop and have our cool red stripe beer. Anyway, spot it some more large, you know? Yes, yeah, some people say no, so the bar kind of close and thing. So, yes, yeah, so I always come and have have me red stripe beer. Any farm I like, I don't want. You can have it at some one place. Big up yourself, punky. Big up yourself, some more. Yeah man, we still have travel through Red Bank same way I got through a tour of the area. Yeah man, anytime meet people me tell us I go through Red Bank, we have to stop at some one place. Yeah man, anything you want on the grill, someone can give that. When you talk about when you talk about them 
boil boil crab someone can give that jerk chicken someone place if you go yeah man so big up yourself someone go to red bank again yes yeah, some paper so no don't know me i show no i go on in jamaica places where we travel all the while places we all some people dream about and hear about but you get an idea what the area is like yeah man so big up on yourself So guys, we are very close to morning side. Yeah man, we are supposed to hear about morning side and place there. Very, very close to the morning side area, guys. We're gonna make a left turn, guys. So you see the sign right here. Welcome to Welcome to Port C. Yeah, Red Bank, you have Rosal and place there. So guys, I'm at the left turn. Take us to morning side, guys. You know, tell me if you don't learn about Jamaica, you know, man, I know the different areas, you know. If you don't really learn about Jamaica, you don't have an idea how the place is set up. Man, I'm picking gongo, yeah, man. Gongo, rice and peas. 